These past few months have been some of the scariest for Kiana Parker. The Richmond mom was laid off from her catering job during the pandemic and is struggling to make ends meet for her family. She has a four-year-old daughter and an infant just born in April. Despite being approved for unemployment, Parker says she hasn't received any of that money. She grew more anxious by the day with no money coming in and had these thoughts racing in her head. I will be in the street or find a shelter, but not too many shelters out here in Virginia. So I want to know what I was going to do. Like Parker, more than 800,000 other Virginians have filed for unemployment and are struggling. Is concerned and panicking about how they're going to pay their rent and how they're going to keep roofs over their children's head and not be out here in the streets um, with their children. There was a glimmer of hope after seeing a recent CBS 6 Problem Solver story about a group of local property managers who started a COVID-19 rent relief fund. We connected Parker with Gene Johnson and that RVA Homeless Intervention Group. After providing documentation, Parker received rent assistance. A huge load lifted for her and her children. Johnson says the 120-day federal moratorium on tenant evictions and filing late fees for renters in affordable housing is almost up and worries numerous renters will face eviction. She says the need is great. Some of the families who are needing help Maybe they didn't have that traditional job, but we have some people who provided uh, services to um, taking care of some of the elderly. They no longer have those incomes. So there's a lot of unique situations um, out there. Both are now thrilled to know CBS 6 News and nonprofit Mission from the Heart Foundation partnered to create the Virginia Together Fund to pull in donations from the community to help with housing assistance. Some donations will also go to Feed More to help put food on families' tables. So it's a good relief for everybody who's going through the situation like I'm going through. Parker wants the community to step in and help. She believes keeping and sharing a positive attitude can bring others in her situation some hope. Because everything's going to be all right. I don't know if people are spiritual or not. Just pray and everything's going to be okay. You just got to keep it pushing. Yeah, I know we're going through a little crisis right now due to the COVID-19, but everything is going to be okay. And I know that the Lord will always make the way.